Hello, Lilas. Welcome back to my channel. Guys, I am so excited. I'm not going to do the full intro. I got to get her on a diaper because of, you know, YouTube little policies. But I want to introduce to you guys my little birdie. Guys, this is Birdie by Elsie Rodriguez. And I am so excited about her. Listen, I'm sorry if you guys are on... um Facebook, you probably seen me. I end up opening her up in the car. I couldn't wait to get home to open her up because I was curious about her size and everything. And I was just like dying to see her. I've never, you know, seen one of her babies up close and personal that I can remember. I might have seen one at the doll show, but don't remember exactly. But, um, you know, I wanted to see the size and the silicone pour and you know all that great jazz that matters when you're trying to paint them and so I was just like oh my god is she going to be too too small is she's going to fit my diapers you know is she going to be floppy is she going to be soft enough would she be stiff you know all that great jazz and I'm really happy with her <laughs> look at look at her Oh my goodness, her just so sweet. I can't wait. So I'll be nesting for her while she wait to be painted. Um, I am going to paint her as African American preemie. She's 13 and a half inches long, guys. And so I don't know what her gestation uh, is. I'm thinking like 28, 29 weeks, which is crazy. I just cannot believe that literally my grandbabies were this small. I cannot believe that. That is so crazy. Um, and you know, I missed that, you know, opportunity to actually interact with them at this, this little, but other than, you know, virtually, but I am just so excited. Um, just real quick on a review because I know you guys, you know, I've had some experiences trying to find, you know, silicone blank kits and stuff like that. But I do want to say that working with Elsie Rodriguez, which, you know, was a quick thing. I wanted, you know, she poured it, you know, and it was a smooth transaction, but she was very personable and very helpful, you know, and, you know, I just, I had a very positive great experience customer service wise um didn't have you know a forever wait i mean so i am just totally pleased with this and um i'm doing what i tell you guys not to do but since i am the one that's painting her and she is going to be mine i did you know take her out i did put her on a diaper i did and i i did try her pacifier for a reason because I was told that I could open her mouth a little bit more if I needed to. And so I wanted to make sure that I could get her passy in and everything. So um, I did open it just a little bit more in there. But it was already where she could take a little bit. But she is so adorable. And she has the cutest realistic little bottom. But I know I can't show that to you guys. But And she does go. Look at this. Oh my God, wait, 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 wait for it, wait for it. Look at this, oh my gosh, it's gonna be so sweet. Let me take this pacifier out so y'all can see her. She does suck her thumb. I mean, if she had an armature, she would really suck her thumb. Look at that, she's so soft. She, oh my gosh, she feels, her silicone feels so nice. Like, I just wanna hold her. But she does suck her thumb. She will suck her thumb. And I love that. <laughs> oh my <laughs> Oh my gosh, you guys know when I get excited, I can't stop giggling. I noticed that I have an issue with that. But, um, yeah, so her details is amazing for her to be so little. Like, her, look, she has little nail beds, and her little feet are, let me show you, her little feet are so cute. And they, you know, they look so realistic. The sculpting on them be so tiny. Look at that. So she has the cutest little, <laughs> look at this. She has little wrinkles in her, in her feet. Look at that. Oh, I want. <laughs> so she also came with um, belly button that I'm going to fuse together. It'll be my first time doing it. Now I can do it as an interchangeable one. Um, I'm not that advanced and I may try it anyway. 
but where she can have like the umbilical stump and the belly button but I'm just gonna paint both of them and then go with the basics but I'm just excited she is a personal baby she's not for sale and hey you guys know how crazy I've been about trying to find the little diapers <laughs> So she actually fit my little diapers. I'm so excited about that. I don't know about the um I don't know if those are nano preemie or micro preemie the um the Winnie the Pooh. I think the Winnie the Pooh is actually let me see if I have one. I think the Winnie the Pooh is actually mm, I think those are micro preemie and not nano preemie. She fits the nano preemie really, really well. I don't have them right here, but hang on. I'm going to try to grab them just to see because you guys know I spend a lot of money for them. Um, so, yeah. So, unfortunately, the the Winnie the Pooh ones that I have are micro preemie. So, I'm going to have to find a baby to fit those. So, I'm thinking like 15 inches will get me to that size. But these are the nano preemies. And see how little they are compared to this one? So, yeah. So, she fits the nano preemie. See, it says NP on it. And I have, luckily, I have quite a bit of these. I have a lot of these. So that's cool. I mean, I could probably put her on that and just flip it down. I can't waste these. I can waste those, but I can't waste these. These diapers cost me about 50 bucks for the pack. So I will be folding this back up and putting it back in the box. Um, but you know how we do it. Like, you know how you fold it down. So I could do that with her and it'll just be big. So like, <laughs> look at this. So I could, you know, you could do this and she could fit it, which will be fine too. You know what I mean? That's cool too. So she'll still wear these probably sometime. But the main thing for me, I think, is that she can fit the Nano Primi perfectly. So yeah. So anyway, so she will go, <laughs> look at this, <laughs> look at this little, little girl, <laughs> look at that, like, look, look how t tiny she is. I don't even know how to, look at this, her little bum bum is so cute. I don't know how to measure her for you guys. Let me see. <laughs> oh my goodness, that is so cute. Okay, so I'm going to wrap her back up in her plastic until she, oh no, we can't do it. I'm not going to do that. That may be traumatizing to some people. Um, I don't know, but she's, she's definitely, you know, I don't know. She's not, she's not much, she's 13 and a half inches, so a ruler is 12 inches. So she's just a little bit longer than a ruler, but she got, like I said, she got some thickness to her enough to where she's not like toy for whatever reason. She don't feel toy to me and I just want to hold her. I just want to hold her. Like, oh, sorry. I was, um, <laughs> I can't stop doing that. Oh my gosh. This is so, I see why it's so tempting when you guys get the babies as a blank and you want to play with them and do all types of things with, you know, get them all cute and everything look look at her <laughs> show up baby flex baby flex for the flex for the camera what's your what's your hashtag watch me <laughs> she she has she's such a cutie though oh my gosh look at this look at this look at this look at this so she's look at that I got good, 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 good. okay so i don't recommend that you guys do that with your babies but oh my god like her little Girl bits look so super real. So I just, yeah. <laughs> they are way real. <laughs> so definitely won't be showing that on camera. But she is she is gorgeous. She is gorgeous. So I'm excited. And she got a little tongue in there. 
um so like i said i'm gonna get her together her ears are well sculpted look at those ears for her to be so little she got all this detail oh my gosh she's gonna be like the cutest look at that little bottom lip she got a little lip see that see her tongue in there she got a little lip oh mama gonna get all up in there yes my goodness so she will probably i'll name her so she'll probably you probably you guys probably won't see her to 2021 i don't know um i got so i keep saying i have one spot for myself um saved and i keep saying oh i don't know what i'm gonna do with that spot am i gonna give it to somebody else i'm gonna keep it for myself or i'm gonna swap out which baby i paint in that spot but I, right now my main concentration is i'm rooting i'm rooting genesis to go home and I got to get Jolie out. And then I have Alex on the table that's just getting started today. Or I actually started yesterday. So, um, yeah, so I got those, you know, I got babies going. And so, but my main priority is to get the two out. And then I have the other ones going. So it's, it's going to be a doozy okay look at that oh my gosh she looks so look at this 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 view like she looks so real <laughs> she's trying to eat mama hand oh look at that i shall wish it he shall wish it wish it oh my goodness her silicone feels so nice and it's sticky it's tacky <laughs> but she still feels so good anyway i'm gonna go Thanks for watching, guys. Bye now. Let me, okay, lay right here. Take your thumb so I can turn off the camera. Okay, you good? You good. Okay. All right.